Hey guys, it's Katie and welcome back to my channel and this week I have a more personal of a video idea for you. So basically, I do wear a back brace. I have to wear it every day for 18 to 20 hours. So I was like, hey, that would be a good video idea. So basically, this week's video is going to be my back brace routine plus my back brace journey so since i like have a specific routine for when i put my brace on when i take it off how long i wear it and stuff i was like hey that would be cool if i show you guys in this video of everything how i do my back brace routine how i wear it um and then later in the video have like a little talking story time of how it's been going and all that stuff so i thought that'd be interesting um i don't know hopefully you guys enjoy it and also, um, before we get started today, I want to let you guys know to enter my giveaway. It ends March 1st, so hurry up, go enter that because you don't want to miss out. And if you are new here to my channel, Katie's Cool Creations, be sure to subscribe down below so you don't miss any more videos. Um, and, um, yeah. Yeah. And anyhow, without a further ado, let's just get on with this week's video. Let's go. Okay guys, so it is about 7.30 right now in the evening and I am honestly very tired. Normally, I get my back brace on around 8 to 9.30ish on a normal evening, but tonight since I am very tired, like I said, I'm going to be getting it on at 7.30. So normally I try to go for a time that ends in zeros because when I add up the hours the next day, it just works out a lot easier. So for me, I'm going for 7.30. So where I store my brace is in my closet. So I'm going to get up, open the closet, get it out and put it on and then go to bed because I'm tired. So let's get up. <laughs> Okay, so I just got my brace here and my pajamas. Normally what I do from here is obviously just put on my brace, but I actually, before I put the brace onto my body, I have to actually wear some sort of t-shirt underneath. So preferably I like to use like a stretchier, more water absorbent. I don't know, they're just more comfortable to wear under this thing. So I'm gonna put the shirt on and then show you how I put on the brace over top. But here is just um, the brace itself. And this actually is a new brace that I recently just got. I will give you more information on that near the end of this video. So if you wanna know more about that, just keep on watching. So I'm gonna put the shirt on and then I will show you guys how I put on the brace. So yeah. Okay, so once I now have the shirt on, it is time to take this brace and put it on. Okay, so basically how this will work is you open it up like this and there's like a clear plastic piece right here. But basically what I do is put it behind my back, open it up, put this side here and then slide this side over here and then put the clear piece under the other piece and then I unstrap it and then hook it up really tight. I don't know if you can see like this line here, but that's where I'm supposed to be. Um, and if I'm at that line, that means I'm doing really good. But being who I am, I like to go way past the line and it really doesn't hurt at all. So, hey, let's do it, you know? And then I do the second strap, hook that one on. Third strap, hook that on and then the top strap. Okay, so all straps are strapped on and it really doesn't even give me any pain. It never did give me pain, so that's great. And if you look at the back of it, right here, my back is supposed to be filled in the hole. And as you can tell, it is filled in the hole, literally. This is what it looks like when it's on. So now, since the brace is on, I clearly just put my pajamas over top. 
Okay, pajamas are now on. I am feeling really warm. But anyhow, I'm going to go get in bed and then I will proceed with the rest of my brace routine in the morning. Okay, good morning guys. Oh, I'm so tired. Okay, well, let's just get out of bed. But, um, so the first thing that I do when I wake up in the morning for my brace routine is obviously head downstairs um, and then sit in my chair at the kitchen table and start working on my school since I am homeschooled. And I always do this in my brace, it just works best. Um, so that's what I'm doing. Um, so here I'm just doing a little bit of my school and my brace still really doesn't bother me here. It really never does, so that's great. And um, here I'm just doing school, like I said, and then I also do get breakfast. Um, but yeah, I do this all in my brace. That's the main point, so yeah. Okay guys, so I just finished my school and normally when I finish my school for the day, I come up in my room and I pick out an outfit and wear it. I still have my brace on so what I'm gonna do now like I said is just pick out an outfit and put it on over top of my brace let's get the outfit okay guys I just put my outfit on the fluffy shirt and the leggings I'm just gonna show you basically what my brace looks underneath it's very hard to tell that I have any sort of thing underneath but if you lift up my shirt here it is um, the whole brace, it's crazy how you can't even tell when the shirt's down over it. But yeah, this is just basically how I wear it. And I will see you guys in the afternoon. So yeah. Hello guys, I'm back. Did you miss me? No, because I was with you guys like a second ago. Now it is in the afternoon-ish. It's three o'clock now, so yeah, the afternoon. What we're gonna do now is take my brace off and then we're gonna add up how many hours I wore it because I have a brace book log thing where I write down every day when I take it off how many hours I wore it for that day. And I am starting to get very hot. I know, crazy, right? I got a t-shirt on, a brace on, and a fluffy shirt on. So I'm kind of getting hot. So let's take it off. Ooh. Okay, guys, I just took my brace off right here. Now, like I said, we're just going to add up the hours. So I put it on at 7.30 last night, and then it's 3 o'clock now. So that is 19 hours and 30 minutes. So I got to say that's pretty good. Um, so I'm going to write that down in my brace book over here. And um, yeah. Okay, that is done. So that is basically everything to my brace routine. Now that you know everything to my back brace routine, I can tell you more about how everything's going with it, if that makes sense. Let's just get right to it um, because you don't want to hear me talking anymore. So yeah. Okay, I'm back. Hello. I have some things written down. So let's just dig right into it. So um, yeah. Some of you may be wondering, like, why do you wear a back brace? Like, what is the point? Okay, so there's like this thing called scoliosis. Definition of scoliosis is basically the curving of the spine. So, <clears throat> why is my throat not wanting to work? So yes, my spine is curved, and that is exactly why I'm wearing this back brace. I'm supposed to wear this during my growing years, so my back doesn't grow even more curved and then have later issues in my life and stuff. This thing is preventing it from getting worse, maybe even um, helping it to straighten up a little. So that is why I'm wearing that. Because if I wasn't wearing this and my back would get to be a worse of a curve, then I would have to get surgery and we don't want that. And then January of 2020, I got my first back brace, this one right here. It's very much older than the one I have now. 
So yes, I do have two back braces because I wore this one all the way up to January of this year. So I had to get fitted for a new one. So I got in a new one recently, but it's working great. Um, I definitely feel it doing something. So yes, I do have two. I'm getting a little collection here, aren't I? So August of 2020, when I was still wearing my old back brace, I went to get an x-ray in the brace. So I had the brace on and they wanted to get an x-ray of it on my back to see if it was actually working. And they noticed that in the back brace, my back was 50% corrected. Yes, it was in the back brace, but obviously it was working. So by now, my back could be for sure 50% corrected. So the degree of my curve originally was like, I wanna say 34, 30 something, 32, 34 something there in the brace when i got the x-ray it was 16 or 14. that is my improvement but that was in the brace like we said but i have not gotten any x-ray since out of the brace so i'm very excited to see what it will be out of the brace and then you may also be wondering how much longer do i have to wear it so all my growing years um basically and i have about a year and a half left of main growing so i have to wear this for another year and a half i know but we'll get it hopefully you guys enjoyed this little story time and that is just a little bit of my back brace journey anyways guys that is it for this week's video um i really hope you guys enjoyed seeing a little bit of my back brace routine hopefully it wasn't too all over the place but i just wanted to give you a little idea of what I do every day um, with my back brace routine since it is a big part in my life right now. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did enjoy this week's video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up by clicking that like button and let me know down below in the comment section if you want to see more like personal videos. I don't know what you guys want to see, so you have to let me know down below in the comment section, okay? Um, also, don't forget to enter my giveaway. Like I said, only like a day or so left so you might want to go under that anyhow guys i love you guys so much and i will see you all next week in my next video Bye bye